All right, Shalom. First and foremost, Monster Love by giving all praises to Yahweh, Bashim Yahushai, Yahweh, who the world ignorantly calls God, and Yahweh Shai, who the world ignorantly calls Jesus Christ. Um, I'm not necessarily sure what I'm going to, uh, you know, entitle this video yet, but I just wanted to, you know, give a few, um, I guess we could say faults, you know, real quick about, you know, uh, you know, stuff that's going on. You know, real quick, I wanted to, you know, say a few words about a couple of individuals. Um, you know, of course, my man, you know, Bon, Gold Bond, Mind of God, as he's known by. You know, he's, um, you know, on there, you know, saying that, um, you know, that the story of, uh, of Jonah was not an actual story. He's saying that, um, you know, the fish... And the story of Jonah was um is basically symbolic of the uh of the world, right? The flat world, with the uh the dome over the world, and Job was in the middle, right? So he was saying that that was the belly, and the fish is the world, which I mean that's just that's <laughs> that's insane. Okay, I mean I I can't even understand how you could come up with such a doctrine. Okay, but that's not in line with the scriptures. Okay, so I did a couple videos, you know, calling him out, you know, show, showing that he's, you know, full of BS, man, right? And, you know, yet to see his response to it as of the time of this recording, okay? But, you know, he's clearly got cut, and then you have this other cat on there. It goes by the name of, um, you know, Concaver of Christians. He's on there saying that he is the Christ, okay? He's on there saying that he is the Christ, man. Okay, I mean, <laughs> just shows you, man, that, you know, hey, you know, what Christ told us to look out for. You know, I should say, Yahawashai, what Yahawashai told us to look out for in these last days, man. Okay, you're clearly seeing it, man. You have false Christ rising up, right? Not just false teachers, but actually people coming up saying that they are Christ. Okay, you got 10,000 people, if not more, alive right now on earth today, as of the time of this recording, who believe that they are Christ. I kid you not, it's the truth, okay, they believe that they are Christ in the second coming, okay, and that honorable mention, as I said before, is, um, my man, um, concaver of Christians, which he believes that he is Christ, okay, another guy, you have this other cat on there, you know, from the Sakari named, um, you know, the gorilla Hebrew, and, you know, he had, uh, he sawed with him, you know, they did a video just the other day, it was about the, um, you know, the age of accountability in the, um, you know, in the Bible. And they were basically saying, you know, it's just t total bullshit. It was saying that, oh, well, I mean, you know, I, I see now, I see now that it only makes sense that you're not an adult till you're 20 years old. And then he brought up, um, what is that, Numbers, the first chapter, to prove, well, see, it says you can't go to war till you're 20. So that means if you're 19, you're a little one. Guy's a damn idiot, man. Because for one, if that's the case, well, what about Numbers chapter 8? Numbers chapter 8 says that you can't work in the priesthood till you're 25 years old. So can I now say that you're not an adult till you're 25 years old? Because it says that you can't work in the priesthood till 25 years old. Come on, man. I mean, are you, are you cats? Wait, are you, are you inside your cat? Right? Are you, are you the damn, you know, peanut butter commercial, peanut butter cup? But anyway, um, you know, I mean, what the hell are you cats talking about? Tell me a 19 year old is a little one. Get the hell out of here. You're going to, you're going to look at me, right? Yasha, look at me there. You're going to tell me I'm a little one. I'm not going to say how old I am, but I'm, I'm under 20, right? I'm under 20. You're going to tell me and I'm a little, one? get the hell out of here, man. You know, and, and let me say this, man. I, I remember, man, going back a couple of years when I was, you know, uh, what, like 15, 16? I knew this one cat that was uh, 17, man. I kid you not, this guy was six, almost seven feet tall, man. This guy was almost seven feet tall, at least six and a half. At least, I would say at very least six foot five. At least. 
right, at least a foot taller than me, and I'm six foot myself, all right, when I was 16, this cat has to be, <laughs> I, I don't even know, but this guy was 17, had a fully grown beard on his face, like, more developed than what I have in this picture here, you know, right, had more of a, you know, beard than mine of God, looked, looked more, he looked older than mine of God, all right, and he was 17 years old, Right, the guy looked like a 40-year-old man, but you're really going to tell me that's a little one. Get the hell out of here. Man, what the hell are you talking about? Damn little one. You know, I, hey, look, man, I even today, I look like a little-ass kid next to that guy. But the point is that we're only 19, or not 19, I mean nine months apart from our birth, okay? Me and that guy, but the point of the matter, and I wish I had a picture here to show him, but I don't. But, um, you know, the point of the matter is, uh, you know, those cats totally, you know, went off with that teaching. He literally said that, yeah, now we know that, you know, 20 plus is an adult, but if you're 19, you're a little one. I mean, it's like, you really believe that? So you're really going to tell me some, you know, 19-year-old, excuse my language, but nigga, you're going to tell me some 19-year-old, you know, grown-ass nigga is a damn child? Get the hell out of here, man. Damn little one hell are you talking about, man? So according to you, according to you, a uh, gorilla, the most high made a world where babies give birth to babies, then, right? The most high made a world where children give birth to other children, according to Sakari. Okay, that's the Sakari's teaching, that the Lord made a world where children give birth to other children. According to, you know, the Sakari, I mean, that's what they have to teach. And if that's not the case, well, then why do, uh, you know, why is the sexual sexual um reproductive system begin years before twenty years old then? If you don't if you're not an adult till twenty. Oh let's not talk about that. Well yeah, of course you don't want to talk about that because you're full of shit. That's why. Okay, because your doctrine is BS. That's why you don't want to talk about it. Because you know you got cut. Right? The the point of the matter, the Bible teaches that you become an adult. 12 or 13. All right, that's what the Bible teaches. Okay, and if you don't like that, well, you don't know the scriptures. So Sakari doesn't know the scriptures. Okay, so, you know, that's one thing. You know, what they're going off on, they're going off with the animal sacrifices in the kingdom. And they're going off on, um, what's the other thing? They're going off on, uh, the, um, oh, the, uh, the temple in, uh, Revelation, what is that, the 21st chapter? That's a physical temple, man. Okay, that's a real temple right there. Okay, that was going to be built on the back of slaves in Isaiah, the 60th chapter. And to prove that, if you read the chapter, it says the gate of the kingdom shall be open continually. Okay, just like it says in Isaiah 60. So you can't tell me that's not a physical kingdom because, for one, it even goes into the makeup of the kingdom, of the wall. Okay, and it gives a measurement of it. Okay, I mean, it's just utterly retarded to, uh, you know, to say that. I mean, hey, if you're gonna, you know, if you're gonna say that the kingdom and that is talking about, you know, oh, well, it's not a physical kingdom, even though it says it is. Okay, so I suppose Vocab is right when he says that Babylon is the whole world then. I mean, how could you argue with him? I mean, it says city, right? It says that city, Babylon, right? So how can he not say that's the whole world, but yet when you talk about the kingdom of heaven, oh, well, that's not an actual kingdom, even though it calls the kingdom of heaven a city. Right? I mean, come on, my brother. I mean, and I'm not trying to be mean. I'm just saying, you know, it's just, it's totally ridiculous when you think about it, how much these guys are going off on, man. Because as I said, I respect Sakura, and I want to see those guys on chariots. Right? I want to see them on, on the chariots, man. But, you know, it just pissed me off to, um, you know, have to deal with, you know, the, the ignorance of those cats, okay? Because those guys don't know what the hell they're talking about on a lot of different topics, man. Okay, so, um, you know, there's a lot, you know, a lot of these cats out here, man. A lot of these false teachers, just as I said, which I get the scriptures, but I don't have the book with me at the moment. But, um... You know, I was just reading earlier in Matthew, was it the 24th chapter, where Christ gives, you know, signs to look out for. One of the signs was, um, you know, there should arise false, you know, teachers, right, false teachers. 
and fast false uh false teachers false teachers like you um and false pastors in the last days man okay so that's what you have rising up now and they have been they have been for years and they're going to continue just like as i said at the beginning of the video the one guy um you know concaver of christians okay damn clown man saying he is the messiah hell are you talking about man but anyway you know I, i'm uh, gonna you know end the video with that just had to you know you call out a few cats on their false teachings um and i'm going to say shalom